you, Mercy Betsy. How are you doing? We're fine. fine. Very, How are you? Very good. I'm doing good. Do you have any question today? Yes. Yes. So we learned about the wise men, right? Okay. And we learned that before meeting Jesus, they went to some palace. Yeah. So did they see the king over there? Yes. That's a good question. That's a very good question because this wise men used the knowledge, seeing the star is the birth of a king, king. They misunderstood and went to the palace in Jerusalem. At the time, King Herod was ruling Judea, it seems. That's what the Bible says. Um, now, after Jesus was born in Bethlehem of Judea, in the days of Herod the king, behold, wise men from the east came to Jerusalem. But what interesting thing is, this King Herod, when he, came, when he heard through the wise men that another king is born, he misunderstood for a competition or something oh. else, so he got disturbed. He was troubled. The third verse says, when Herod the king heard this, he was troubled and all Jerusalem with him. Not only oh. him, the people of Jerusalem was also, they were also troubled because of the news that king is born. Oh. A new king is born. It's, it's really a pathetic thing, yes. right? Because this wise man, seeing the star coming and telling that they came to worship the king, but the real king or the king of this earth is troubled because he feels that as a competition. Yes. That's how he missed to know and worship Jesus. What pathetic situation is, right? Yes. Today also, many, they are omitting Jesus for various reasons. A group of people were joyful, angels singing, there's a good news, everything else is there. But this king was troubled. He was troubled, disturbed along with his people in Jerusalem. My dear beloved, let not anything trouble you to know the truth, the true nature of Jesus Christ, the truth behind the birth of Jesus Christ. Unlike Herod, don't think this is a competition for you, for anything else. This is not competitor. He is not the king of this earth. He is the king of the whole universe. All the earth and heaven belongs to him. Come and know Jesus and worship him. And God bless you.